What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel, Dudu's Toy Lab. Today is not a normal toy review, but this video will help you upgrade your laptop. And it costs only $25. I have an old laptop with me and we bought it in 2013. And it was an i3 model with a 4 GB RAM. And it holds a hard disk drive. And I'm going to replace the hard drive with an SSD. And it's under $25. To upgrade the laptop, we need three things. The first thing is the SSD. You can buy 128 GB SSD for less than $15 in Amazon or Walmart. This one I bought from Walmart for $46. And it's a 480 GB one. Next is a screwdriver suitable for opening your laptop. And the final thing is a SATA to USB connector. And this is a 2.5 inch SATA to USB 3 connector. Before upgrading a laptop, we have to do some steps. So I copy most of the data from the laptop to the external hard disk. Now the data in my laptop is less than 480 GB. Now let us start the upgrade. Connect the SATA cable to the SSD. Connect the SATA cable to the laptop. Or you can call it USB port. Now the disk is showing in our laptop. Open your laptop drive. Now it's showing your laptop and the extra SSD. And it is 447 GB. All is free. And the laptop holds only 388 GB. Because I have copied the rest of the data to an external hard disk. Now we have to copy the OS and all other programs to the SSD. To copy the operating system, we need to install a partition wizard. This is mini tool partition wizard and it's an easy one. Click on the first link. Go to your products. Click on partition wizard free edition and download. It is downloading. And it's completed. Click on the executable file. Select your language. It may take some time to install. Click on I accept. Go to next. The partition wizard will be in installed in this drive. If you want, you can change it. I leave it like this. It's just asking to create a shortcut. It's okay for me. Click on next. Oh wait, it's an additional software, so I don't want that. Now click install. It goes fast. Click finish. So this is our partition wizard tool. You can see lots of options in this tool. Like data recovery, partition recovery, and migrate OS. We are going to migrate the OS to the SSD. So click on the migrate OS. It will show two options. Option A. I would like to replace my system disk with another hard disk. B. I would like to move my operating system to another hard disk and keep the original hard disk in my computer. We are going for A because we have to change my old hard disk with a new hard disk. We can see two hard disks here. One is the computer hard disk and the second one is the SSD one we just added. Now select the SSD. Now we have to copy the OS and all other programs to the SSD. 
all the data on the disk will be destroyed. Are you sure you want to continue? Click yes. There are two copy options. We are going with the first one. Click next and then finish. Click apply on the top left. Now it shows a message to close all other applications. So let me close all my other applications. Now the migration of the OS started. I'm changing the camera because I need to stop the recording software in my laptop. It is asking for a restart since some background processes was running in the laptop. Let me click on restart now. The laptop is restarting and the rest of the process will be taken care of by the pro by the partition wizard. The copy partition percentage is showing on the screen. It is more than 90 percent age and will be finished soon. The data copy is over and the laptop got restarted. Now the data copy is done. Now let's take the power cable off. Remove the hard drive. Remove the battery. Now let's take the screws out. We can see the hard disk drive and the RAM. You can see two RAMs here. This laptop came with one RAM, but I added the second RAM to get more performance. Now let us take the hard disk out. Use the same screwdriver and unscrew the screws. The screws are removed. Now let us take the hard disk out. Put the hard disk back in this direction with this piece of plastic. The hard disk is out. Let me take that out carefully. The hard disk is out. Now let's add the SSD into the laptop. For that, all we need from this is this frame. Let us remove the screws and take the frame out. The frame is out and now we're going to fix it in the SSD. Let me screw back on. The bracket is fixed in the SSD. Now put the SSD back. Let's connect the tip to the connector. We have to pull gently. Now let's put the screws back. Doing the deck screw. Ugh. Now let's put the cover back. Now it's time to put the battery back. Uh. I did it! Let it switch it on and try. Let's switch it on. <gasps> it worked! It worked! Whoa! Let's check the passcode in. Don't look. This should be the right. The laptop is ready back. You can see all the old programs from the old hard drive is still present in the new drive. And we didn't even do a Microsoft reinstall.
All the folders and data are still available in the laptop. We can see the new SSD here. All the old softwares are still available. I have upgraded my laptop with an SSD and now it's lightning fast. You could also do that on your old laptop. And it costs only $25. $17 for the SSD and a 5 to $10 for the cable. You can get the SSD to the USB cable at Amazon or Walmart and those are cheap. If you like my video, smash that like button and subscribe. Bye!